Hi there, I'm Ziba, and thanks for joining me. In this video, we're going to do a brief overview on what a dosha is and why it's important. So Ayurveda is based on the premise that everything that's out there in the universe is also in us. And Ayurveda teaches us that there are five great elements known in Sanskrit as the Panch Mahabhuta, the five great elements. And these five great elements are earth, fire, water, air, and space. And these five elements combine in different ways to form three very unique mind, body, spirit compositions known as doshas. So there are three doshas. There is the dosha of earth combining with water, and that's called kapha dosha. We've got our dosha of water combining with fire, that's pitta dosha. And lastly, we have air combining with space, and that's called vata dosha. Now, all of us have all three doshas. It's just a matter of which one is primary, secondary, tertiary, and in what ratio we have them in. So for example, I am vata pitta dosha. And there might be someone else who's vata pitta dosha, but they might have a different composition. I might be, say, 40% uh, vata and 30% pitta, and the other person might be 50% vata and 20% pitta, the remaining, of course, being all kapha. And because our ratios are different, the imbalances that we have will also manifest in different ways. And so what Ayurveda does is it uses the dosha to kind of diagnose uh, where your imbalances currently are, what your propensities to certain illnesses are, so that you can better take care of yourself today as a preventative measure going forward. And the doshas are also used to see where you can create a balance so that your other doshas can balance too. Because ultimately, Ayurveda is all about bringing all three of your doshas in balance. And what you want here is a situation where even though we might all be born with a slightly different imbalance in our systems, sometimes it's like a scale. You gotta add to one side, you gotta subtract from the other side, or sometimes you have to do both. But the beauty is, sometimes when we fix the imbalance in one dosha, the others will naturally correct automatically. Thanks for joining me.